So this video is going to be about our search for the cottonmouth. It took us almost a month and a half. We walked a shit ton of miles, and I mean that literally, like a lot of miles, with kids. It was hot, it was miserable, we caught a lot of snakes along the way, had a lot of fun, but this one took us a long time to find it. And then when we finally found one, we saw him again, less than a week later. So here's our story, here's the search for the cottonmouth, here's our pictures. The quality's probably going to suck because a lot of it I videoed off of video because it was live, I didn't have video on my phone. so. Not like most of our videos don't suck anyways. Or the quality isn't crap, but here it is. Cottonmouth. Oh my God. <laughs> what? What do you want me to say? I don't know. Just wing it. Like you always do, baby. <laughs> Just wing it. Do it for the fans. Do it for that one fan we have. Starting to think we don't have fans. Yeah, starting to think no one watches our videos. I don't even watch the videos. <laughs> oh, damn. I'm just That's messed up. I'm just God, I gotta quit saying cuss words. <laughs> it's really annoying editing all that bleep out. I'll just start doing that, beeping myself. Why are you doing it on me? I don't know. So, Num Nuts broke our stick last weekend. So, now we got a hose clamp with some duct tape on there. Yep. If you need some professional tools, look us up. We'll hook you up. That way you look like a, yeah, I got them bars, baby. That way you're looking all professional like us. Also pretty high on Red Bull, both of us. Oh, whoa. Whoa now. There goes the camera. We're good, we're good. Okay, that's only $200. It's all good, though. We're good, we're good. All right. Daddy, what's next you on the fun today? Mm, probably a cop Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, what's next you on the fun today? Or do you want to find them? Cottonmouth. We're going to see if we can outdo them in their video. Supposedly this track has a lot of water moccasins and common water snakes. Let's outdo the reptile hunters. He's really high on Red Bull, by the way. And I drink a lot of coffee. And it's 9 in the morning, and we're like 2 hours away from my house. Let's get it. Right. Yeah, technically. We did find frogs and millipedes and snails. That's about it. Yeah. So, where are the cotton mouse that everyone says are here? Just playing in the dirt. So the reason we picked this spot, I didn't really pick it, but I mean I did. But a lot of friends of mine, friends, whatever, people that I know on other groups told me that there were cotton mouse here. Showed me pictures, told me locations. So we started looking, put on our rubber boots, went through the swamp, miles, miles through the swamp. Never could find anything. God, what was it? That was a snake eating a damn frog. Please tell me that's a cotton mouth. Come on, baby. Where did he just go? Where did it just go? That was a snake eating a fucking frog. Where did it just go? Wait, 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 wait. Here's his head. Right there. It just poked up for a split second. Right there. Right past that twig. Is it a cotton mouth? Stop talking every time I turn the camera on. 
<laughs> You're so stupid. <laughs> stupid. So we're not giving up. So today we brought the rubber boots. You can kiss my ass when you say we don't know where to look. We're in the swamp. Swamp, 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 swamp. They push the rain back. It's not supposed to rain till like three. Sun's out. Guns out. Oh baby. Let's see if we can find us a damn cotton mouth somewhere. This is the area. It's not seeing them. They're here though. Maybe. Hopefully by the end of this video I have some badass pictures of a cotton mouth. Still no cotton mouth. We came out harping at night. And we're gonna try to look for some venomous snakes because a lot of venomous snakes are nocturnal. So we're gonna see if we can find anything. It's day right now, but it's gonna be pitch black. You can even see your hand, so. We're gonna be good. We're gonna start herping. So there is thunder, and we're not sure it's like a little, I don't know what you call it, uh, a creek, and we're looking for water moccasin, it's thunder, and we can hear uh, frogs are like talking to each other, it's really weird, and yes I do have the hiccup. Ugh. I don't know if y'all can hear that, but... Well, please could if they had both cuts. Jeez, I don't know for you guys, but everything's turning like black, white, gray, like right in here. And like some of it's green. Like, like does that not weird? Like black, gray, white. It's just weird. Some of it looks just black and white. Like here looks like black and white. Here doesn't. Well, like up in there it does. That's weird. So, I'll get you on camera if we find a snake or something, so, bye. Yep, came on Monday, like, leave it on Tuesday. The only thing we've seen are frogs and, uh, or, uh, shit. Yeah, yeah news, thank you. Yeah, we did see one more scorpion, but no snakes. A lot of frogs. Oh, we saw a ringneck earlier. That don't count. Come on, bro. We need something venomous. We found a new spot, and today we're gonna look for some venomous snakes, maybe. I hope like a copperhead, cottonmouth, any venomous snake, that'd be amazing. So, we're gonna hunt. So, shirtless sexy man. Yeah. <laughs> you, my brother. No, the other one. So, uh, why aren't we finding snakes? I don't know. Where are they? After a roll passage, we're gonna have to do the ritual. The ritual? What? Yeah. What's the ritual? Y'all saw it in a couple other videos. I'll do it again. You guys have some looking for El Snacos? Yeah. Yeah. Why do you think we could do it quickly? I know. Uh, no, because we're going to look retarded. The There's we a woman do. behind us. Y'all know there is I really don't know. I'm just saying that so he'll not go on what about it. Do? Do it it poured him. rain last night, man. I know. Should be epic timing in our epic spot, but it's not. Don't worry, we'll do the ritual. Jeez, people, calm down. He said he'll do it. I know you like our yeah, videos yeah. and you want to subscribe, so just do it. Oh yeah, please. Nipples. Please. Uh, <laughs> please subscribe because whenever we hit 100 subscribers, we're going to land between the lights. So. Sweet. He's begging. You're gonna say that on every video, aren't I you? No, because I want them to do it because I want to go to land between the lights. Oh well. There's that. All right. Well, we'll see if we no, find anything cool. Yeah, if not, it's gonna be a really short video. What? There we go, So then, Dominic. He joined another Facebook group, and it was for this particular walking trail, and just randomly clicked on a thread. It wasn't about snakes at all. And on the thread, somebody had posted a picture of a cottonmouth, and I knew exactly where that was. But it was on the exact opposite side of where everyone keeps telling me to find cottonmouths. 
So we went and looked, nothing. And every time we walked there, I would look because I knew where the picture was taken. And sure enough, I'd, we were about to give up, about to go home. I could literally see my car. It was that close. So I walked down the creek just a little further, just last ditch, last ditch effort. I don't want to go home, you know. And my son just looked down. He's like, Daddy, is that a dead copperhead? And I just looked down. And when I did, the words, that's a water snake, almost came out of my mouth. And then I just realized that there it was. The cotton mouse that we'd been looking for was literally right in front of our feet. And we had no idea. The cotton mouse, right? Can I see it? There's a cotton mouse. Right there. Daddy just picked it up. I found it. I thought it was a dead copperhead. Daddy moved it to land to get some good pictures. We finally, finally freaking did it. Cotton mouth, baby. There he is. One of Tennessee's four venomous snakes. The one we've been looking for, cotton mouth. That was right there in the water just swimming. I used my hook to get him out here so we could get some good pictures. The reflection in the water was messing our picture taken up <laughs> mr ash Reuters found that one whoa you zoomed in way on your face good find my dude you I did looked, say copperhead yeah first. i looked over and i thought it was a dead copperhead just because uh the hershey kisses but then right. i saw the dot in the middle and you said cotton I was like, oh. yeah and what else what about their eye uh it has a line right here and pit viper yeah, well, they're both. Pit, pit yeah, they're both pit vipers. All Tennessee yeah, snakes are pit vipers. Mm -hmm. We found him. So it's kind of hard to see in this light what he's talking about. But you can kind of tell. They have a little Hershey kiss pattern, but copper heads are more clean. People say these are like pixelated, where it's just more jagged. Then they also have like the bullseye in the middle. <laughs> And their eye, they have a solid black line that runs horizontal down their face. Oh, and I'm not even showing you this. My hand's shaking. And cotton mouths are famous for that. They'll stand there. If you get close enough, I'm trying to get him to do it. I want him to open that mouth like cotton mouths do. Because I want a picture of that before I leave. But he's not wanting to cooperate. He's being good, though. See if we can get some cool pictures of him. So fast, that was on a Monday. So fast forward, this is Saturday or Sunday, maybe Sunday, I don't know. But anyways, so we go back, like what are the chances of seeing that? Dominic literally said 20%. So we go down there, like maybe he's still here. Couldn't find him, couldn't find him. So I just start walking through the creek. All of them had stayed up on the trail. One of them ran to the Port of John, of course, because that's where they live at, their boys. So I walked like 15 more feet, crouched under a branch, and as soon as I did, he sat right there. Same snake. I could tell he had like a, an old wound to his tail, so I knew it was the same snake. But not 15 feet from the place I'd seen him days before, and not 15 feet from that, where that picture was taken, where Dominic saw in a group, the whole reason we started looking there is just crazy. A whole, I mean, three and a half miles away from where everybody says they're right here, which I know three and a half miles ain't far, but when you're walking with kids, it's kind of far and annoying and hot. The cottonmouth here, we're gonna see if we can find it and see if it's still here, because everybody sees the cottonmouth here. Do you think we'll find one? Do you? Okay, and he has the camera. Okie dokie. <laughs> Let's see there. Cut. Cotton, how are you, buddy? Cotton. Can I hop on the bridge?
There's nothing right there where that picture was taken. Here, I'm in front of you. I stand in front of you. Take a meter up under this bridge, pop your legs. What are the chances? I already told you 20%. There's a cotton mouth right there. I'm gonna take one more video. Okay, let me see it good. There's the head. There's the body. It's not the best quality, but this is as good as it can get. I'll try to zoom out. That is the cotton mouth. There, just taking a picture of it. It is right here, and I'm just sitting here on this tree. So I'm getting some horrible light bouncing off the water. Take my pictures and video, but there he is. Our second cotton mouth we found at this location. Pretty cool dude. Horrible spot for photos. Hmm? Oops. What was that? A frog. Oh, is that a bullfrog? I heard that. That was weird. He's really calm too. Yes. Well, last Monday we finally found one after our long search, and boom, got us another one. It has way bigger. Second venomous cotton, cotton mouth. That's way bigger. Well, today's our day. Water hole is deep. Jumping, I'm the You're gonna jump in that. Huh? You're gonna jump in that. Yes. That for real will go over your head. That's deep. I know. And you're wearing khakis. Hey, Austin Stevens. Yeah, Austin Stevens. Go. I'm afraid that's gonna be under there. You can see. But can I dive? No, it's not that deep. Well, I don't think. It's whatever, do whatever. Whatever you float your boat. No, you what? Are you gonna dive? No, you're I'm not. To. Sure. Don't go straight down. Oh, I never knew. Just do it. <laughs> what the? Okay, count down from ten. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go. <laughs> and he flopped it. And My name is Peter Austin. Getting the perfect photograph of a wild animal is no easy task. But I don't let anything get in my way. Last weekend we saw a cottonmouth. And then this weekend we saw the same cottonmouth. It was pretty cool. We took some cool pictures. Uh, like... Daddy dropped and it fell in the water and it was still calm. That was, that was pretty cool. This weekend has been really fun. We jumped in some some water. We hunted for some snakes. So, see you next time. Please like, subscribe, and share. And see you next time. Bye.